open the Bitwind Offshore app. To download the latest forecast data, drag the green start waypoint and the red destination waypoint to your desired locations. The relevant grid area and other associated forecast data will automatically be selected. You can manually adjust this area by selecting the grid view from the main menu, then by dragging the corners of the white box on the map. Click on the waypoint icon to manually edit the waypoint GPS coordinates. Here we can also add and delete waypoints to the route using the plus and minus symbols. However, you should minimize the waypoints so the routing algorithm is free to find the fastest route. We will download a weather route and grips with a file size suitable for a first time satellite connection. You can add or remove other parameters once you become comfortable with the download process. Once our waypoints are set, tap the green download arrow from the top right corner. This moves us to the download settings page. Here we can change our parameters, which is very important for satellite and low bandwidth connections. The app comes loaded with suitable default settings for a satellite download. Grips on. Then tap on Grip Preferences. Forecast model. We can select the models we want to visualize in Grip format. Keeping in mind that the weather route, which is only 10 kilobytes, will have all variables for all the models. Interval. This is the time step of the grips. We have 12 hourly selected. Days is the number of days. We have five days of groups selected. Resolution. We can choose 100 km, 50 km, or highest res available. Highest res available gives us the highest resolution modeling. This would give us a very large file size, too big for our satellite connection. Then we can select other forecast variables. The default settings are wind, rain and pressure. Other options are wave, gust, cape, air temperature and cloud. Tap back. Now we can check our weather routing is turned on. Here we could also select departure planning to select the best day to depart or a spot destination forecast to get a seven day table format forecast at your destination wave derived from the highest available resolution grip files. These features require the standard or professional package. We will select our weather routing preferences. We can choose to prioritize for the fastest route or for comfort. Comfort settings set the parameters we want the weather router to try and avoid. We will choose fastest time and use our seamanship to make the best routing decisions based on that information. Tap back to weather routing preference. The default start time is now, or you can select the time in the near future. The time is based on the time zone of the device. We can also set the motoring options polar percentage to change the speed up or down of the performance polar we have previously set in our account. Professional users can turn on ocean and tidal currents for weather routing. Tap back. We can also change the preferences for departure planning if we are using that tool. We could adjust the departure spacing and models used. Next is the GMDSS forecast, which is a small download and important for checking weather warnings. Observations can give some insight into the actual wind readings in the grip area we are looking at. The next option is ocean data. 
For this download, we have it turned off as it's covered in another tutorial. The next setting is satellite imagery, which is another option, but a larger file to download, so we will leave it off for now. Tracking data allows us to update our track manually and also bring in data from buddy boats or boats in our rally. Now that we have these download settings, they will remain the same for future downloads. At the bottom of the screen, we now have our estimated file size. In this example, we have a file size, which is acceptable for a satellite phone download. Tap on the blue bar to continue to download. First time users will be prompted to enter their predict wind forecast subscription login details. Now we are on the downloads page. Here you can select your connection type. Web is for land-based internet connections, Iridium Go, Redport Optimizer, Global Star, Satellite for other high bandwidth satellite connections. A satellite connection without a direct connection capability, you can retrieve weather data via email. It is important at this stage to check that your Wi-Fi is on your chosen connection type in the device's Wi-Fi settings. Once you have connected to your Wi-Fi, match the connection type on the top menu in the Downloads box. Then tap on Download All. When the files download, it is important to take note that not all models have the parameters available you may have selected. Check what you have to avoid confusion later. The downloads page must stay open while you are downloading. Once all of the files are downloaded and have a tick next to them, tap on the close button. We are taken to the weather routing tables that have detailed data for our weather route in graphs, wind, summary, Route, Wave, Atmosphere, and Current. This is also where the export function is for the weather route. Next, we will tap on Map. Here we can see our weather routes and groups together. Tap on the play button to animate the routes. You can control this animation speed with the control toggle. The boats and groups will move in time. The colour of the route is related to the weather model. The animation can also be controlled by moving the ball on the slider or using the left and right arrows. You can view the wind in three formats. Streamlines, wind barbs with pressure contour lines and wind speed gradient, and directional arrows with pressure contours and wind speed gradient. In addition, the other forecast variables such as rain, cloud, air temp, gust, cape, and wave can be viewed by tapping on the relevant menus if you have downloaded these parameters. Use the standard pinch and drag to zoom and pan the map. To change between forecast models, tap on the forecast model at the bottom of the page. To hide any or several weather routes, tap on toggle routes at the top of the screen. You can turn off all routes to look at the groups only. Use the main menu to view other forecast formats. Select GMDSs from the main menu, then tap on the link in the middle of the GMDSS area. GMDSS forecasts are text safety warnings that are written by meteorologists from the responsible regional Met Office. To view the satellite images, select Satellite Imagery from the menu bar, then tap on the link in the middle of the satellite image area. You can select between colour or black and white image. For ocean data, Please see the Ocean Data Tutorial. You are now ready to explore the Offshore app for yourself. Please contact us on support at predictwin.com if you have any further questions.